Jeffrey goes on to self-improvement YouTube videos and leaves black pill comments. Imagine being called a f***ing Jeffrey and a guy imitates you putting on a helmet, bro. This is how you know black pillars are just f***ing lost. This advice is stupid. It wouldn't work for a 5'2 Indian janitor because you're, you're six foot Hamza, so we can't take your advice. If Jeffrey just put half of the time that he spends commenting this bullshit on YouTube videos into going to the gym, he would make enough progress to start attracting women. But he doesn't. He's lazy. He's the bottom of the bucket crab that wants to pull you down. So are you gonna let him? You see these comments on our videos all the time. They want attention and they wanna pull you down so that they feel better at the bottom with you. Don't succumb to that pressure. I should have been blackpilled. When you see pictures of me when I was 15, 16, 17, I wasn't attractive and I thought that I was actually pretty damn ugly. I, I was certain that my brown skin made me ugly, that I could never attract girls here. If I stumbled across the black pill and incel forums back then, I probably would have fallen for their trick. They get young guys who are lonely and they strip every bit of hope away from them. I am lucky and so privileged that I didn't stumble across that community. Adonis. Adonis is a man full of hope and he transfers that hope to the men around him. That's what brotherhood is for. He believes in himself and he believes in his tribe. He brings them up. He can't understand why there's so many men who would rather pull you down. Adonis looks in disappointment to the average men of today. They've given up, but they won't stop up until more men have given up with them. It's a shame. One of the most common comments that these black pill spurgs leave on my videos, and you've got to know, okay, the comments that you see under my videos are not all guys on self-improvement. You have to be wary. I've said this on my stream before, that these guys are trying to infiltrate. They're like, they're so f***ing weird. We're here talking about meditation, and they'll come in and tell you that meditation doesn't work that you should just be black. It's fucking weird, bro. But these spurgs will come to, and you will see them comment below. And you'll probably see them comments on this video. And one of the most common comments is this advice, this self-improvement advice wouldn't work for a five foot two Indian janitor. Like I'm telling guys, okay, if you build your dream body, you'll start attracting more women. Of course you will. But they'll say, oh no, it doesn't work for the five foot two Indian janitor. These little spurgs, these white 23 year old males who've got up posture they think that they're speaking for the five foot two indian janitor but the five foot two indian janitor is happy with his life he's got a wife of 20 years he's got three children he came from india to the us or the uk and he's a hard-working man who's actually fucking fulfilled unlike these guys the jeffries the black pillars use this example as an excuse for them to not need to do the work we tell them Yes, meditation works. It makes your mental health better. And when your mental health is better, you attract more women because people actually want to be around you when you're not fucking weird, when you're not just like talking to yourself and you're not disassociated. We tell them, yes, go into the gym because not only does having a sexy body, of course it fucking helps, but of course it gets you more matches on Tinder. Of course it gets you more like attention on Instagram. Of course it gets you more attention when your clothes actually fit nicely. But these guys don't want to hear it because it's something that you can control. We tell them that and then they say, oh, but it wouldn't work for the five foot two Indian janitor. Any excuse, the thing is this video is not for them because those guys are too far gone this video is for you if you find these comments below and you find yourself wanting to reply to them you are a loser these guys are already too far gone so if you take that like i always see this in my comments and one of the worst things is that my boys take their time to reply to these guys you've got to know they are too far gone you can't convert someone who doesn't want to be converted if they are open to self-improvement then yeah invite them to the channel but the thing is they, they're not they're here specifically to try to put you down the only way to win above these guys is to completely and utterly just ignore them like some like disgusting looking f***ing pest like you know when a crackhead comes up to you and he starts like he stinks and he's asking for money or some sh and the, the vibe that we all have it's like that's the type of shit we need to do to a black pillar now because the worst part about these guys isn't that they're black pilled it isn't their belief system. It's the way that they go about recruiting more men to be losers like them. Here you are trying to improve yourself and they will come to an area where you are trying to improve yourself and they will tell you not to improve yourself because it won't get you more girls. And it's always that same convenient story of like, oh yeah, but like uh, muscle won't get you girls. I don't have muscle right now, but I, I, I swear I had lots of muscle previously, but there's no, there's no pictures, but I, I swear I had lots of, shut the f up, bro. Just shut the f up, bro. This, this, 40 year old man type of bullshit of like the you know the 40 year old sports coach or something who's like oh i used to deadlift 300 shut the f up bro show me a video bitch show me a picture of you jacked bitch like you won't show me it so the black pillars watching build the 10 out of 10 body first if you don't get women i will cry with you build the 10 out of 10 body first keep your mouth shut and just go and see what happens they use examples like we waffles uses examples of like short guys who have built the 10 out of 10 body and he's like oh but it wouldn't work for him go and ask him bitch Go and ask him, because if it didn't work for that guy, you would see the same guy would have stopped lifting, wouldn't you? 
If it didn't work for the guy, you, we would see this clear, consistent, popular dynamic of ugly sub five, like these guys call them sub five, right? Sub five guys getting jacked and then losing the muscle, but you never see that. You see them getting jacked and you see them keep the muscle. So it clearly fucking worked, but they don't want to talk about that. Do not let these men pull you down. Do the hard work, especially when you don't know. Do not let these boys, do not let these fucking cretins, these goblins, these fucking smeagles pull you down. Do the hard work, especially when you don't feel like it. Mwah.